Happy Friday, everybody. Today marks the end of budget week and I'm down here at Perrin Park to share some great updates with you. I'm really excited to see you all this coming Monday, the 24th of June for our Monday Fun Day at Golf Links from 9 a.m. till 12 noon. Please bring the children along and enjoy the first day of the school holidays for free putt putt. We've got golf simulation, we've got the reptile experience, music, free snow cones and popcorn and free coffees for the adults. So I look forward to seeing you all on Monday. Now going back last Sunday, I had the pleasure of attending the Fig Tree Pocket Equestrian Centre and the Fig Tree Pocket Pony Club who were celebrating their 50th birthday. So this pony club, an excellent community group, was established in 1974 and this year it marked the 50th anniversary. Um, congratulations to everybody that's been involved with the Pony Club to reach this important milestone. And I look forward to seeing where we head in the future with the Olympics um, around the corner to see whether or not we can be involved further. Like many of you in the community, I'm also very disturbed by the amount of illegal dumping that we see on our footpaths here throughout the Walter Taylor Ward. But rest assured, curbside collection is just around the corner for all those large items. So on July the 15th, we have St Lucia and Turinga curbside collection. And on August the 5th, we have curbside collection for Fig Tree Pocket, Indrapilly, Chapel Hill and Tuong. A quick shout out to Artspace Tuong. They have gifted 20 art packs to the Queensland Victims of Homicide Support Group. What a kind gesture and I'm sure very welcomed to enhance their well-being. These packs included pencils, paints, uh, paintbrushes, sharpeners, all different resources that they can do art with. So well done Artspace Tuong. In other great news, I'm delighted to see at the old Tuong Avery site, which is now Tuong Central, that all of the hoarding has been replaced. I do urge you to pop down and have a look. You will see the history of Tuong, which tells the tales from early 1800 up until now and really gives us an indication of how Tuong has transformed. So for the end of budget week, I would like to share some of the great things that will be occurring throughout Walter Taylor Ward. Here at Perrin Park on the dog off leash area, delighted to be seeing some upgrades happening to the small dog area. As well, all things dog off leash, we'll be making improvements to the Green Hill Reservoir and also Anzac Park dog off leash area. So that's excellent news. So here at Perrin Park, I am delighted to show you that we have done some repairs to the potholes through here and some levelling. But part of the investment for the budget for this coming financial year will actually be resurfacing this access road, which is an amazing thing. I mean, further good news for budget related investment. There'll also be some work occurring through several of our parks here in the Walter Taylor Ward. Um, at Anzac Park, we have scheduled works. At uh, Robertson Park, we're actually looking at a new toilet block through that area, which will be great to also assist with the high demand that's um, coming through on the Lex Ord Park South and new dog off leash area. And we'll also be doing some work through uh, Turinga Playground Park and Keating Park as well. So um, this is all great news for all of our uh, lovers of the outside world and improving our lifestyle. Just to finish off for this week, I wanted to make a point of discussing the Mogul Road corridor upgrade. You will notice if you're a motorist using this area that there have been a few switches that have occurred recently and there is more to come. So uh, if you're heading along Mogul Road and heading over the overpass, now you can actually go straight across on the overpass and head down onto Coonan Street. So we have traffic traveling in both directions on the overpass. It's feeling like things are um, drawing to an end and it looks like uh, the project is on track to be finished around the end of this year. So please stay up to date with all those switches as they occur. There's more to come in the coming weeks. Until next fortnight, have a great week.